Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to convert customary units of capacity. So fluid ounces, cups, pints, quarts, and gallons. And along the left hand side of your screen, we have seven practice conversions that we're going to go through together in order to get this down. Now up top in blue, we have some notes that we're going to reference in order to do these conversions. Now over in the blank area on the right side of your screen, I'm going to take those notes up top and create um, another way of putting the notes that I think is more helpful, uh, but you can decide and use it if you'd like. So again, these notes up top, or I'm going to uh, draw something else that may be helpful to you. So we're going to start, and I would suggest you draw this out with me. If you find it helpful, uh, then great, you can use it with your conversions. So we're going to draw a big G. And that G represents one gallon. So one gallon here. Next, we're going to draw four Q's. That represents four quarts equaling one gallon. So four Q's to fill that gallon. Yours is probably going to be neater than mine. So next, in each quart, we need two pints. So two pints equals one quart, and eight pints fills one gallon, or equals one gallon. Next, we need two cups in each pint. So we're going to put uh, C's in each pint. So a cup, if you can think back to your kitchen, and a measuring cup, one one cup, and how many of those it would take to fill a gallon. So think of a gallon of milk. We would need 16 cups to fill a gallon. Now lastly, we have eight fluid ounces in one cup. Now that's just going to get too small to put uh, eight fluid ounces in each of those C's, so we are going to leave that one out um, of this here. So let's go into some conversions. And again, some people prefer, prefer to look at notes like the uh, notes up top, and some people prefer to look at the G, um, and then what fills that gallon. So as we go through, you can use both or use whatever you prefer. So number one, two gallons equals how many pints? So the first thing we need to do, how many pints in one gallon? So if we take a look, we have eight pints in one gallon. So that means there's 16 pints in two gallons. So two times eight. Number two, six quarts equals how many pints? So in each Q or each quart, there are two pints. So we want six of those. So six times two gives us 12 pints. Number three, three gallons equals how many quarts? There are four quarts in one gallon, so we need to do three gallons times four, which gives us 12 quarts. So three gallons equals 12 quarts. Again, four quarts in one, so there would be 12 in three, or three times four. Number four, 24 fluid ounces equals how many cups? So if we take a look up here, we know that eight fluid ounces creates one cup. So we need to split this 24 fluid ounces into groups of eight. Each one of those groups of eight is a cup. So we need to do 24 
divided by 8. And that's going to give us 3 cups. Number 5. 5 pints equals how many cups? So let's take a look. There are 2 cups in 1 pint. So we need to find out how many in 5. So we could do 5 times 2. That gives us 10 cups. Number 6. 8 cups equals how many fluid ounces? Alright, so there are 8 fluid ounces in 1 cup. So we have 8 groups of that 8 fluid ounces. So 8 times 8. That's going to give us 64 fluid ounces. Again, one cup has eight fluid ounces, so we have eight of them. So eight, 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 eight times. So we would, we would do eight times eight, and that equals 64. Number seven, 32 pints equals how many gallons? There are eight pints in one gallon. So we need to split this 32 pints into groups of eight. Each one of those groups of eight is one gallon. So we need to do 32 divided by eight, which gives us four gallons. So there you have it. There are some customary units of capacity conversions, and along with some notes that I hope were helpful. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.